Mercury retrograde. So if you're going through some kind of fight or breakup, let's get the energy on that. Okay. Feeling really guided to do this one. I'm just feeling like I need to split this deck. Okay, so six of wands are reversed with judgment in reverse. You just... You feel like this is gone this is really unfair how this went. Six of Wands upright means you have a victory. With judgment in reverse, it's like you're failing to see this person reap what they have like thrown at you. You're waiting for karmic retrib retribution. You don't see them encountering what they put you through and it sucks. They hurt you. Yeah, they turned their love away. They, um, you feel rejected. Wheel of Fortune in the reverse. Yeah, you feel like everything is going wrong. King of Cups in the reverse. This person is highly manipulative. Very emotionally manipulative. Unstable. They act like they're working towards the connection and then they fall back. They put in effort and it's like love bombing and then disappearing. The fool and then they go off and they like start something with someone else and then they come back and they make sure they still have you. Three of Pentacles in the reverse, yeah. It's just been such an uneven give and take. King of Swords in the reverse. Just very abusive energy. King of Swords is the king that wins wars. I'm just understanding that instead they were the King of Cups in reverse. Very manipulative person, emotionally abusive, unstable. King of Swords in the reverse. With the Page of Pentacles, they're coming in with some kind of offer of stability. What I don't like is that I'm getting this vibe that they're no longer emotionally unstable which is good they're a little more balanced maybe they were going through stress in their life that caused them to be unbalanced however they're more calculated because they're more balanced so watch that this is just what happens when you're really like aligned the universe is like this is what it is all right you guys have a very like lust filled connection you, there's so much attraction here you guys get lost in each other you see each other and it's over like you just can't keep your hands off each other too much of a good thing is a bad thing is what i heard also i saw 333 so you might be seeing the threes now hierophant with the knight of wands this person's looking for a higher commitment with you. They want to be in a situation. I feel like they just realize, yeah, this flame, they just have a passion for you. They want to be connected to you. They're afraid to lose you. They're afraid that you might find someone else. Maybe even talking to someone else, they feel it. This person is coming in because they're afraid that you're gonna leave them. They're losing their hold on you. Seven of cups with the lovers. They just, they know the passion that you guys have. They know the effect that they have on you. They're going to try to seduce their way back into your life. With the Page of Pentacles. Again, exactly. Page of, this is too much of a good thing is a bad thing. Do not let them come in all fast and furious on you. That will go bad. That's just what I'm getting with those two cards especially. The fact that that crossed my mind and then that card popped, no. Be very careful. They're going to, I think that they want this commitment. They want you, they recognize you as their person. They want this to pan out a certain way. 
but I think that it gets too hot too fast and then burns out. Queen of Wands. You need to take time to get to know each other on a deeper level where you're being vulnerable to each other. There needs to be more than just sex. Yeah. Ten of Swords. With the Two of Pentacles. This person is going to take... I think that... I'm seeing that maybe we were two different cards. I think that maybe you guys are different. And like, um, you run with different groups. Where their families might feel like you're, you're not the type of person that they would see with their child, whatever. Like, it depends. Everyone's situation is different. Take it how it applies. In some way, you're different than what they would normally date. But because it hurts them, the idea of losing you, they're going to take the risk of people questioning them or, or maybe you wouldn't fit into their social group because you have a different view on things and you might be loud about it. You know, there's something that they're afraid of, but they're going to move past it because they don't want to lose you. This could be... Uh, for some of you, they left you at the last Mercury Retrograde and now they're coming back on this one for some of you. Eight of Swords with the Knight of Cups. Yeah. As soon as you go to get with anybody else, you talk to anybody else, you take their, your attention off them, they come right back in and they try to get you in your feelings and out of... They don't want you to be thinking about the connection. They, they want to approach in a passionate way that's the knight of swords this person knows you they know the effect that they have on you they will approach you in a way that you will not be able to say no to so whatever they did in the past they're looking to slip under the radar because they know they messed up but they also know what they want and this person is very good at getting what they want someone's smiling about that too Yeah, Four of Wands, very playful energy. But there's love underlying. It's like burning passion. Four and four. You might be seeing four, four, four also. There's like a fatal attraction vibe here. Just want to see for the future what are their intentions? What are their intentions over here to stay? Three of Wands, they want to remind you of the way that you used to feel so they think that you've fallen out of love maybe you have maybe you haven't either way they think that you have so they want you to be under their spell is what i'm hearing nine of wands that little shit and if you break this down three 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 they know if they don't come in and fix this you're gone they know they feel it they're rushing in to save this. Justice. What are they going to sacrifice? Hose. Just kidding. Oh. Um. Hold on. You, they have a sex obsession. Yes, they do. Interesting. But you're indifferent right now. You're not reactive to them. You're not reaching for them energetically or physically or verbally. Like you're 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 like whatever goodbye. They're they're coming forward because of that. But with justice and the devil, what are they gonna sacrifice to make the connection work? Their addiction to sex. So they're a player. Can't keep it in their pants. I feel like they're just watching you. Yeah, I mean, this is totally irrelevant. This is just a download. It's like they're watching you and you're the queen. Like, 
I, I, I don't care if I love you. I will leave you. You don't treat me well, goodbye. Adios. See you never. If you go back with them, if you take them back, make them work for it a little bit at least. The Empress, sitting pretty. With the Five of Pentacles, they're going to ask you to um, take it to the next level. They want a serious commitment here. Yeah, they're determined to get it too. The magician with the sun. Look at this face. They're not playing. They want you. Okay. Yeah. Face of Cups, this person and losing you realize that they love you. My marriage card in the world. They want to give you everything. Yeah, you're not speaking right now, but that's about to change. Let's see what they can do. Oh, my God. So pay attention to the red flags with healing family issues. Right off the bat, codependency. Something with their family, the way that they were raised, it causes them to have unhealthy ways of communicating which have caused the relationship problems in the past or maybe that's you but either way they're um they're working on themselves i think you might be manifesting this person into what else do they need to know finances and career This is where that difference comes in where like, you guys, my, your finances, career, like your career and your religion, they might be, um, they might not mesh well. Maybe they're super religious and you're, you're like sciencey, you know? Free yourself. Passion and soulmate. Also, this is my twin flame card for this deck. So passion and soulmate with free yourself. Free yourself from the boundaries of, okay, well, this doesn't physically fit. So I can't be with this person even though I love them because people will think this. We are energy. You need to do what feels right to your soul. Passion. Mm. Look at this. Passion, true love. Calling in your soulmate. Calling in your soulmate. One more. Keep an open mind. Yeah, don't judge a book by the cover. This is a new start to love and it's safe for you to love. Very soon this is coming in. Very soon this is coming in. So this is someone coming back. If it resonated for you, please like, subscribe, and share.